Hi guys, I'm Basby here. Welcome to another YouTube video. And guys, um, I'm starting off here on this web website, guys. But that's not what this video is about. So guys, I'm going to show you in the last video I recorded um, on my new website. I'm going to show you how to make that program in Java. Um, so, so it's right here. How to make a temporary word processing document if we go to, where is it? What do, we, what do we want to use? I'm going to use Eclipse. You guys use BlueJ and NetBeans and any other job IDE that uses GUIs. Um, what is it? All right. So if I go to, where is it? Where's the story right here? So let me type in Eclipse real quick. Eclipse, uh, let's find it. So go launch Eclipse, or launch a new uh, thing you can run, not enter. Let's launch Eclipse. Um, actually, let's not use Eclipse. Actually, no, no, let's not use Eclipse, no. I forgot how difficult this is to use. So, okay, let me try a different one. This is NetBeans, actually, that might be easier to use. Um, NetBeans may be a lot easier to use, actually. Find NetBeans. Uh, that means right here. NetBeans 8.2. I think this might be out of date. I'm not sure. This is a very old download, I think. I uh, like very old. Um, see, NetBeans. Uh, this is not my MacBook. This is uh, my grandpa's MacBook Pro. Anyways, I already have a thing set up, so that's why I want to do this. Uh, if we go to, let's close this. Let's go to RamPad.java. Also, we're naming this. Um, so we are going to have to import a few stuff. If I remember correctly, you want to import uh, Java, what is it, java.swing.star. Let's see, there's a bunch that works, hope it works. Uh, run, and I think it's it. No, that's not it, okay. That's, okay, so that's not right, Java X. Uh, I have zeros, okay, let me test again. Um, Clean, 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 clean. Yes, this is right. So, um, uh oh, uh oh. Let me check out the source code real quick, one sec. Uh, all. Where's the Java files thing? Uh, uh oh, I didn't save it. Okay. So, I need Java programs. My Java BlueJ workstation, that's what it is. Um, sorry, my brain's not working right now. Let's do grandpad of Java. Let's open the source code. So, okay. So Java X on screen, that's right. Um I use import, yeah, I use import. Um next we're gonna do is we're gonna do public class. Next we're gonna declare the public class. So get your formatting correct and let's do public. That's alright. So okay it's public, it is case sensitive. Public class and then class and I'm gonna name it rampad for now. Uh, and then we hear this oops, and this. You wanna do this. The brackets like so, and then see. Um, that's a better way. Is F11 okay? It's F11. What's F11 do? That does not do anything. I just it's broken. Okay, so come in. That guy doesn't compile. What the heck? This is a hateful mic. Does that work? Does that work? Yes, it does work. Okay, and next thing we want to do is we're going to do a public static void. Oh my goodness. Okay, anyways. Uh, we're gonna do a main, no, not right here. We're gonna do a face main and strings args and then bracket bracket and tab in. What is this? Oh, that's right. Public. Okay. Should be right. Then we put it. Um. Okay. Ah, oh, no, no, no. What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? String, string, string. Ah. Create a strings and public classes by Joe. This is alright. But what did I not do right? It is strings, right? It is, oh, that's why I didn't do right, okay. So it is string. Um, oops. I'm very sorry, I'm not sure what's wrong with me today. Uh, string. Uh, now let's try it. Really. And it's super hard using a Mac uh, program in Java because the commands are just funny. Uh, this is where I'm up out just in terms of annoying. Uh, with the uh, schemes, um, I guess in uh, sorry, I think. Text it. Okay, so now we need to do a while true loop. And what the while true loop does is it basically what it does oops, is it parentheses. I'm gonna fix this formatting later. Don't worry. Uh, uh, but while true, it basically means that it repeats it on and on forever until the value is false, which will never be false until you close the program. Which is pretty good, dandy. 
Yeah, and then let me compile it again. And then let me while it's compiling. Okay, so we're gonna declare the string. Um, so I said here string. I'm sorry, user, user input. Now you can name user input whatever you want. I'm just naming it user input. And then you want to do equals null, which basically means nothing. Uh, this makes it, this makes helps it. And then what was the next? Oh yeah, so so next we're gonna do hmm, all right, user input equals j option. Oh, it's one of the center. J option chain dot show. It's just wrong. I'm sure. Show input dialog. Parentheses, parentheses, semicolon. That's on. This one's on. That is on. Oh, uh, this one's on. This is safe. I'm doing it wrong. I uh, use the input equals. I'm doing it right. Oh, right. Okay. Show. This should be capital S or lowercase s. That's clean part. Build project. This one's. Oh, that's right. Another. Okay. Take on technical difficulties. What this wrong now? J option. Oh, lab capitals. Nice. What, what's wrong now? So let's do parentheses. Does that work? And clean project. Compile files to clean build project. Should work now. Yes, it does work. Okay, yeah. So next we're going to do before this, we're gonna name we're gonna have a title. Um we're gonna have a title for the program, like uh like a a tag, whatever you want to call it, I'm not sure it's called. So we're going to do null, comma, you don't have to do this for the input, input, but for our purposes, we are going to do that. And then we're going to do R A M P A D. You can name this whatever you want again, or you don't have to, but I recommend it. Or name this whatever your program is called, and then you want to do comma, uh, quotation marks, R A M P A D, and then comma, oops. Oh, what is next? I did not remember this. I, mean, I just learned this. Okay. So next thing to do, let's copy this real quick. Um, so this, so I sit here, ram pad, your option pane, inf the information message. This thing right here, uh, the thing right before this is what the title is going to be called. So this thing right here, like Eclipse, like this thing here, uh, this is what it's called. The, if this uh, thing was ram pad, this program we're running, NetBeans was not NetBeans, was RAMPAD, it would look like this. But if, this is basically what the title is right here, up here, you know what I mean? Um, now, it's kind of complicated, but I'll get to that in a second. And the next one to do, um, what is it? Uh, so you're going to do show, um, yes, no, show, J, oops, J, and then option pane. How long am I not sure? J option pane. I'm going to something else. Equals no. All right, my bad. Show. Uh, I'm so bad at typing. I'm not sure why. Show message. I was so good yesterday at doing this. Show message. Dialog. Um, null, comma. Oops. And then user input. I can do this. User input. Comma, and then uh, ram, oops, ram, pad, ram, pad, and then comma, and then j option, j option, hang. Uh, if you're still sticking around at, at this part of the video, that's awesome. I don't think you are, but whatever. It's, um, what just happened? I'm not sure. Anyways. Um, yeah, and then you want to do, let's do caps like what is happening, what is happening, what is happening, what is happening, what is happening. Okay, 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 soft, soft, soft. I have no idea what just happened there. Information underscore uh, message. Is that right? That's all right. Is it right? I'm sure. Caps like off. Let's compile file. F9 doesn't work. If we press F9, I'm actually scared what happened if we press F9. Nothing, nothing, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't do anything, because like, Mac is broken, I hate Mac's shortcut keys, I hate, there's no way to press like the F12, maybe there is, not sure, but actually I don't know, whatever, um, so that is good, see here, so I just walked, what is wrong with this, import, uh, I package, oh, right, so the package, 
It's perfect to go right through package and NetBeans, that's annoying. Package. You don't have to do package, but I'm using NetBeans, so yeah. Package, RAM, pod, comma. So I'm not sure what is wrong with this. What is wrong with this? Um, I'm gonna just go right here. Encode package, encode package show. What is all tensor? Show him. All tensor. I press all. Oh, that's not all tensor. Let me do command Z. Uh, all tensor. Move past the correct folder. Change package to decoration to RAM pad. Ah, okay. That makes sense. Okay, I was about to say, I'm so confused for a second. Like, why is this not working? Okay. So, what is this doing? What is this, th what is this thing fit? Something value has never used. Exactly. Well, like, we don't, I'm not sure. Do we need this? Let me see. We might not need this. If we don't, then we clean it. The project, then we're going to run it. If it works, so it pause correctly. I didn't know, I thought you had to use null, but whatever. So, let's try run, run project. And should create this thing right here, Java. Sit here, if it loaded, click on it. Oh, we don't have to click on it, never mind. So here, um, I just thought I could RAM pad right here is, is right, this J option pane shirt and pedal like this is RAM pad right here. The first one is right here for this one. And then the title right here, RAM pad, is for the second RAM pad that is, or the second title, which is before J option pane. Now you don't have to do any of these, you can just leave them blank. Um, and I'll show you that in a second, hopefully. But it's right here if you do, hello, I'm, this is a very bad spot of Spanish, but whatever, because I'm not using an accent, but whatever, it's Kipasa. See, that's it here. Uh, hello, Kipasa, this is what uh, user input gets the user input, and the user input right here gets user input from the input and displays the output, and RAM pad right here, and then J option right before J option pane information message is right here. And, um, don't believe me that we don't need to quit this real quick. If you don't need these titles, you might not say, well, what do you, what, if, you don't, if you don't need these titles? Well, what we do is I think this works, I'm not sure. Uh, let's do, that's not right. Let's again, run, compile, file, like Supreme Build Project. So I'm thinking this works. I mean, if you don't do anything right here, let's say you don't need this either. If we, this is, I mean, this thing is very customizable, not very, but can be, you know what I mean? This MacBook is about to fall into the sink. That's not good, because I'm standing right now. Um, so that might be why I'm not typing that as good as it was yesterday while I was sitting. Uh, just, I'm at a kind of awkward angle. I'll stop cleaning it. Okay, good. So I sit here, if we just leave this blank and just do null, use input. What happened is something pretty drastic, or not necessarily drastic. I, why I do that? Wrong button. So one project, that's okay, one project. So we have to wait for the spin up and yeah. That's okay, good. So here, blank message, so it just says input right here. Let's do test. And yeah, it just like does, it, it basically does work, but, um, let me use ramp pad, put ramp pad. Um, so I'm, right now, actually now I'm going to do what I'm doing. So actually I'm going to try that. I'm going to find the finder. Actually, I'll probably put a video right now while I'm waiting. Um, um, but anyways, guys, hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, one sec, one sec, one sec. If you have enjoyed this video, please smash the like button, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys next time. And, um, and uh, well, goodbye.